All right, sorry you got to look at my face. I only have the one webcam right now, and it's pointed this direction, but we'll get through this. I just, I got my MakerBot last night, and I wanted to show this off. This is a test for a new coupler that I am doing uh, to join pond to pond and rooks to ponds. Um, and the, the, you get two of them together, and they join together like that, and they hold together nice and tight, and they come apart. Uh, fairly easily it'll be different when there's a whole chess piece associated with it but still it comes apart all right here's here's the principle behind what's going on okay uh, since it's in black ABS I had to make this illustration it's got two dots that are raised and then a wall around the outside edge it's kind of like the top and the bottom of a Lego um, flipped and inverted against each other and the the clever part was I realized I didn't need to have this fourth wall on there that I could uh, leave that open and when you get a second one on it it's still let's see can you see through there yeah um, it still contacts the the wall in two points on each circle and that's enough to keep it tight enough in fact most of the time Legos like the the six or eight dot lego pieces they only contact on the walls on the corners of the walls so i don't need that fourth wall so this works out really well and it holds together really well the problem with this piece is it's not um it doesn't look good from many angles uh from this angle it looks fine but from the side it's just not symmetrical and that bugged me so i thought what if i were to take this piece split it down the middle and mirror this side uh, and so I tried it, and this one this one was printed in white ABS, so it comes through really well. And you kind of get this leaf shape with the dots and the circles on it and the two walls, but it still generates enough uh, contact that when you get two of them together, they're, they're at 90 degrees to each other. Um, actually, maybe they're... No, they're, they, they, they are. No, they're at 180 degrees to each other. Who cares? It works. It holds together nice. It comes apart nice. So this is the coupler that I'm going to add to my knights, or I'm sorry, my, my rooks and my pawns um, to make them work. Uh, I wanted to show the, the body that it consists of the king and queen. Um, and, you know, there's the detail on the face. There's, there's the backpack. Fan, it looks fantastic. I'm absolutely absolutely pleased with the way this turned out um there is something funny with the queen that i changed the top part leans in just a little bit and it's extremely subtle you can't tell looking at this um maybe you can i can't tell looking at it that it but it causes that when they come together that since the only point of contact is at the bottom this whole area up here tended to you know waver well now it now it forces itself in so it works really well, I think. Um, so that's new body. So hopefully with the new couplers, new body, tomorrow I will have a fully functioning new version and altogether uh, version of this that comes apart, that goes together, that holds nice, that's playable and functional and woohoo. So watch watch Joe's MakerBot.blogspot uh, for pictures of that tomorrow. Woohoo!